I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong. For this game, I'm going to have a three fawn minimum because I intend on playing at Mahjong time where there are tables with an eight point minimum that equates to three fawn. So I want to practice finding score in my drawn hand and making decisions during the game so that I can get to that eight points before anybody else. Well, I'm playing by myself, so technically. Anyway. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles are out. They're mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way, we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. East will get 14, South, West, and North will get 13 each. Then, we'll look at everybody's hand and figure out where to get score. East will discard and we'll start the game. Everybody has their tiles, so let's see what we can do for player one, also known as East. No flowers, that's one fawn. Here's a challenge, three, three, five, when you have mixed suits like this, it's gonna be really hard to get to three fawn. That's gonna take a while unless we pair up these. These are valuable tiles if we can pair up and pung. I think I would probably hold the ones and nines. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's a hand called 13 orphans. 13 orphans is one and nine of each suit, one of each of the winds and dragons, and any tile paired. So I think that is a possibility. It's really hard to get though. It's one of the hardest hands you can get. The other option would be a half flesh with dots. I would discard these first. Let's see what happens. We're gonna look at south now. Three bams, three cracks, five dots. That's going to be a challenge. Single honors also will be a challenge. This dragon, if we pair up, we could pung for a fawn. The only redeeming quality at the moment is that they have two pair. But that's a long ride to all pung. All three of a kind. We need three more pair. This is going to be quite a challenge. I think what I would do is discard these two first. Because if we could pair up that dragon and maybe draw in another pair, we could try to play all Pung, all three of a kind. Right now they have no flowers and that's a fawn, but we need two more fawn from somewhere. All Pung is three fawn. Let's see what happens. We're going to look at West now. Two, four, five. It's going to be a challenge here too. They have one pair. Single honors. We'll see what happens. They're kind of in a similar situation here. We're gonna say that this solitaire game is East round. So if they pair up either one of those, they could get score for that. They also have no flowers. So that's a fawn. We'll just have to take it pick by pick here. 
Let's see what we can do for north. Three flowers. One, two, two. Player one, two, three, four. They won't get score for these flowers, but we can get replacements. Dragons. Singles. Not helpful, at least right now. And now we have four, four, three. So everybody is in the same predicament. I think this player is probably the closest with a half flesh by one tile. Actually, this player, no, they have more honors by one. It's going to be tight. We'll see what happens. No pair. No pair in here at all. So let's start by discarding a five crack and see what happens. Five crack. Nobody can take it. We're going to draw. Up here, you see we have a four, six, and a six, seven. You might think, well, why not get a three in a sequence from that five? like four, five, six, or five, six, seven. You can only claim a discard to complete a chow, three in a sequence, from the player on your left. This player is on this player's right. So we can't take that. We gotta draw for south. Three dot, okay, they have a pung. If you draw into a pung, or a chow for that matter, you keep it concealed. The only time you need to expose anything is if you claim a discard, and you have to have the tiles to go with it. Let's go ahead and discard the nine bam. And nobody can take a nine bam, so we're gonna draw for west. White dragon. All right, well, that could bring score if we pair up. Single honors. Not helpful. Let's go ahead and discard this two crack. Up here we're gonna draw, because nobody can take it. Eight dot. All right, there's a pair. Now, we need to figure something out here. Two crack was discarded. Let's discard that. We need to find some score here, and chows are not going to do it, because all chow is only one fawn. And they have three flowers, and none are theirs. So we need to get score from somewhere. Probably all pung or half flush. And they have one pair and mixed suits, unless they pair up these dragons. Let's draw. Four dot. Well... That's nice. Half flush potential. Let's discard the six crack. Nobody can take that, so we're gonna draw. One bam. That's not helpful. Let's discard the one crack. Drawing four west. Three crack, they paired up. Now we have two pair. Let's go ahead and discard the two dot. And we can draw here. South. Okay, well that might help them get to a half flush. Why don't we get rid of these cracks and start working our way there? The six crack was discarded, so let's discard that. So only four of everything. All right, we're gonna draw for east. Two dot. They're drawing dots. Let's discard that two bam. And draw for south. Seven dot, paired up. They have one, two pair, and a pung. Let's go ahead and discard the one bam. If they keep drawing well, maybe we can sacrifice this and go for half flush. 
one bam, nobody can take it, we're gonna draw. Seven crack, not a keeper. Let's discard it. Look, it's looking like nobody wants cracks, just based on all the cracks that are out right now. We're gonna draw four north. Eight crack, that's not a keeper. Seven crack was discarded, let's throw that. Nobody can take it, we're gonna draw for east. Six bam, that's not a keeper for them. Six bam, nobody can take it, we're gonna draw for south. Nine crack, that's not a keeper. Six bam was discarded, let's discard that. If you're playing all pung, you want to keep fresh tiles so that you better your chance of pairing up. And the six bam was thrown. Okay, so six bam, we could chow that, but we would have to sacrifice a pair. And they have two pair at the moment. Let's just look at chow potential. One, two, three. They actually have a chow right there. I think I'd rather draw. Because if we go with a half flush, by com committing to chows in a suit, you're going to have to sacrifice these pairs. I would rather draw and see if we could pair up or draw bams or pair these up. Three bam. Okay, now there's a pair. One, two, three pair. It's looking a little better for all pung, all three of a kind. So let's see what happens. We're gonna discard the six dot. So six dot, nobody can take it. These are chow potential here and here. No pungs, or potential pungs, I should say. Let's draw for north. Nine crack, that's not a keeper for them. Let's see here. Yeah, they have one pair. Oh my gosh, this is terrible for them. Let's go ahead and discard the nine crack. And we can draw for east. Six dot. Okay, their half flush is really coming in. Let's get rid of the five bam. Five bam, nobody can take it. We're going to draw. One dot. And their half flush might be coming in too. We might have to sacrifice that eight crack right there. Let's discard the four bam. And up here now, okay, we have to decide. Are we gonna push for the half flesh and sacrifice these pairs or hope to pair up and pung? I think because they have three pair and they'd have to throw away four Let's see, one, two, three, four. Mm. One, four, bam. That if we chow that for three, four, five, that would leave an isolated seven. I think I'd rather draw two crack. Not helpful. It's already been thrown twice, three times now. Let's draw. Four bam. Oh, let's get rid of this four crack. And draw. Six crack, that's a discard. Drawing four south. Red dragon, single honor, painful. Let's discard the nine crack. And we're gonna draw for west. West, that's their seat. Okay, we have to decide now. Let's go ahead and see if we can get them to all pung and discard the one bam. Up here, I would not commit to bams. We would have five discards and we're heading into the middle game at this point. So I would not take that they might even consider switching to defense if they don't pair up those honors.
let's draw. Two crack, last one. Everybody's had six discards, nobody's ready to win, no exposures. We're gonna draw. Five crack. Nobody can take it, drawing for south. Four dot, oh wow, that is a surprise. Okay, so let's see chow potential. One, two, three potential. Here's a potential pung, potential chow, potential pung or chow. These all, except for this north, have value. We have one, two, three, well, two pair and a pung. Let's discard the north and see what happens. We could still maybe pung if we pair up. Let's draw. Three bam. Now they have a pung right there. I think we should try to pair up and pung here. Let's discard the four bam. The four bam and five bam are out. We're gonna draw here. I don't think I would chow. That would leave two isolated tiles. They already have a chow with a two, three, four anyway. There's a nine bam. All right, well that's looking a little bit better. Let's discard the eight crack. All right, now, right here, we need to decide. Let's just look at the blocks here. One, two, three, four, all we need is a pair. I'm gonna let it go and go for a half flush. We're gonna draw. A bam. Drawing for south. Five crack. Four bam. Oh my gosh. That's not helpful. They already threw that. It's already out. Drawing here. Four flower. They got their own flower. That's a fawn. And now it's looking like they're half, they may be coming into a half flush here with chows. Now that that four bam is gone, there's a couple five bams out. We'll see what happens. Let's discard the one dot. Okay, down here, we can't take it. We need a three dot there. Let's draw. South. Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of the one bam. These single honors are not gonna be helpful. We gotta pair up. Nobody can take a one bam, so we're gonna draw. There's a north. That could help them get to a half flush. Let's get rid of this eight crack. Even though they threw a north, maybe they'll pair up. Let's draw. Six bam. Okay. So now we need to pick something that's out. Six bam, five bam, they're out. Let's discard the five bam. So five bam, now I think we could go ahead and consider taking it. Let's chow. We'll chow for north and try to get them to a half flush. We need to pair up. We'll discard the four dot. And nobody can take the four dot. We need a five dot here. Let's draw. We need to pair these up or draw dots. One crack. Nobody can take it, we're gonna draw. Seven bam, we'll discard that. Up here, we can't take it. We need an eight bam or a five bam and they're in chow, so you can't chow from the player across from you. So we're gonna draw. Eight dot. Discard. 
okay? They're committed to BAMs. They've already got a chow, so we're not gonna take that. We need to sacrifice that eight dot. There's a three flower. White dragon. Let's get rid of the eight dot. Eight dot, can't take it, can't take it, can't take it. Four flower. Five dot, that was a good keeper right there. Let's get rid of the nine crack. And we're gonna draw here. Five crack. Drawing here. Five dot, that's not a keeper for them. We, we need to pair up. Six bam's been thrown, let's throw that. Okay, now here, we could chow, but that would leave an isolated nine. I think I'd rather stay concealed and draw. Maybe we'll pair up in honor. No, but we paired up the nine. Let's discard the eight dot. And nobody can take that. Eight bam. Can't take it up here. Oh, three flower. That just took their no flower fawn. Nine bam. I should have probably thrown that eight crack. Up here, let's pung. All right, now we're going to get rid of these these single honors here. Let's get rid of the south. Nobody can take it. We're going to draw eight bam. Drawing four south. East. Oh, single. That's going to hurt. Eight crack. That should be safe. We're going to draw for west. Seven crack, that's been thrown. Drawing for north. Nine crack, safe. Drawing for east. West, oh my gosh, look at all these single honors. Okay, we have to make a choice. South was thrown, let's discard that. We're gonna draw now for south. Oh, they got a south, already two out. We'll throw that. Drawing for west. Seven, bam, they paired up. Wow, that took a while. Pair, pair, pung, pair. So five dot, there's none out. Let's get rid of these scary tiles here. Very valuable. We're heading into the end game. So we're gonna get rid of that east and nobody can take it. We're gonna draw. Six dot. Six dot, pung. Okay, pung, now east was discarded. Let's throw that and we're gonna draw. North, they paired up the wind. It's not theirs, but it'll help them get to a half flush. Let's discard the east and draw. East should be safe. Okay, we are going to draw now for north. White, they paired up. That is an honor too. That, that will bring them a fawn if they could pung. Let's get rid of the red dragon. Nobody can take it. We're gonna draw west, paired up west. Let's throw the red. So that could help them. We're gonna draw north. They got a pung. 
Pung and North, we're gonna throw the red. So they got that Pung, that's nice. So we have a Pung here, isolated one, four or five potential Chow, potential pair, or potential Chow. They still have work to do, as pretty as it is. We're gonna draw flower. They just lost their no flower fawn. Nine dot, not helpful. Let's get rid of the red that's been thrown. And we can draw for north. Three dot, let's discard the three dot. They're, they're getting closer. They're still two away though, or one away from ready. Okay, three dot, we're gonna chow. Now, we could chow. This player could Kong. If they were to Kong though, that would take away, actually we could Pung it. Because here's the three, four, five. Let's see here. If we Pung it, that would leave a three, four, five and a potential Chow or Pung. They could Chow it, but a Pung takes precedence over a Chow. Let's Pung. Okay, we could Chow here, Chow here, Pung here, or Chow here. Let's get rid of the green dragon. Nobody can take it, so we're gonna draw. Five Bam. Okay, we need to pair up here. Five Bam's been thrown. So let's throw that and draw. Three Crack. I think I would play to win. Let's see, I put that in the wrong place. Three Crack. Here we're gonna Pung. So let's see, it would be, let me see here, like that. That would be for West. Okay, now, five dot, I don't think there's any of those out. No nine dots are out, no Wests are out. This is their seat, let's throw it, because others may not hold a West, because it's not their seat. But in this case, we have a player with a pair. So we're gonna Pung right there. And now we're going to discard the green dragon and nobody can take that. So we're gonna draw south. That's been thrown, safe tile, drawing four west. White dragon paired up. Let's discard five dot, nobody can take it, west, drawing four, east, two bam, nobody can take it, seven crack, drawing four, west, two dot, okay, now, there are a bunch of eight dots out, let's discard the nine dot, Maybe nobody wants the nine dot, but in this case, we're gonna Pung it. Okay, now we need a pair in here. There are three eight dots out, let's throw that. Safe tile. We need a pair in here. And uh, eight dot, let's chow. Okay, we have a Pung there. We have a Chow here. None of these are out. There's one of these out in an exposure. A Chow, let's throw that. So this is South. Okay, we need a one dot to win. We're gonna draw seven dot Pung. Okay, here we go. They're gonna discard the two dot. 
and they're ready to win on a seven bam or a white dragon. Okay, now nobody can take that two dot. We do have a potential chow here, but you cannot chow from the player on your right and they're not ready to win. They have no pair. So we're gonna draw four crack. We're gonna draw for east, two bam. Drawing for south, eight crack. Eight crack, we're gonna draw one crack. Drawing for north, two dot. That's a good safe tile. Down here, green, that's been thrown. Drawing four south, three crack. That's a pung out there, so that should be safe. We're gonna draw four west, six crack. Okay, six crack, drawing for north, two more picks each. Six bam, they got ready. Oh, they're ready to win on a three bam. Let's discard that green dragon. Ready to win on a three bam, here we go. Four crack. Drawing four south, one dot. Mahjong, self pick. They only had one more pick left. Okay, so pair three, four, five. Here's a pung of three dots, a chow. seven, eight, nine, and a three flower, which they're not gonna get score for that because it's not theirs. Okay, so we have half flush. This Pung of North is not their seat wind. This is the seat wind for this player, so they won't get score for that, but they do have a half flush. Any wind or dragon with any one suit is a half flesh. So they'll get three fawn for that. Three fawn, self pick. They get paid double by everybody for self picking. So they're going to get a thousand from each. Okay, 1,000 from each player, because they self-picked that one dot. Could you tell that I was surprised to self-pick that one dot? There was only one out, so either the one dots were in the wall or in someone's hand, in this case, east. I think that was a pretty nice self-pick for that half flush. Three fun, but self-pick, you get paid double. It's a nice way to go out. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Be sure to click the little gray bell when you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.